This is one of my early WordPress themes that I really started like early on. It came out some years ago. Um, and it was actually one of my favorites at the time when it came out because it offered some features that other things didn't have. It had been in the market for some time now, but even though it had the, this WordPress theme been on the market, I still believe you guys uh, will like it. Right now, it's actually on sale for $49. It actually was, the price was $69, but right now it's actually $49. It offered great features for, for if you're looking for the start your WordPress theme as in like directories or listings, something like that. It does offer shops as well. So, I, you know, I think you guys will like it. I want to show you guys, give you guys an option to check it out. And you can you can compare it to some other some other WordPress themes that's already out there that offer similar features. So I'm gonna show my screen right now and I'm gonna show you um the theme right here. So let's go into it. Let me share my screen. All right, here we go. So as you see, this theme is called Listify. It's a directory WordPress theme. And as you see here, it's on sale for $49. And I'm going to stroll through it. So just give you a quick walkthrough. So here is the support. They offer great support. Here it lets you know what they have changed um, throughout the WordPress history. Here's docs. So you can, if you want to read that docs, you can read it here. Here is some more information about it. This is their page where you will purchase this WordPress theme. So you would, I'll put a link in the description where you can um, purchase it and check it out for yourself and see what you think. Okay. Add to it for um, appointments. They offer this appointment file. Um, let's see what else they have on this page. They give you, oh yes, you guys, they actually have one of the best, um, styling. So they offer a styling plugin. That's great. It changes a lot in, um, with the styling, the colors, the shapes, the design. Um, I think that you will actually probably like the design of the plugin, probably maybe more than the theme, but it offers great features. Uh, I'm telling you, um, some WordPress themes do not offer great customization, and this one does. You can customize this theme with the plugin and great features, as you see here. Offer great performances, speed, speed page, a Google, Google Love it. As you see here. So, what else we got going on? Plugins they support. WooCommerce, Contact4, there you go. Let's see. That's kind of it right there. So let's I'm jump right into uh, one of the first demos, which is this one, the classic view. Got that. So here is, you know, of course, it's a search. They want to know your location as they try to find your location here. They, here is a... Um, and again, you can edit this as well. So you can edit this. This has been, it's like little blocks you put on and you would set up the home page how you like it. So this is the home page. Here is like the tags. Here is the listing. And this is their first one that they came out with, which is nice. I like the color. Let's go into a search. Out of this, it just keeps trying to pour you. Each in here we go. So, here uh, I will show you 
So again, you can, it can search by your location as well, of course, but here is all of the listings. As you see, they have right here three rows, or you can also do two rows. And here's your icons, which you can change this icon inside or put a bed or whatever you want to put in there. You got your logo, the title, the address, and the phone number. And this right here is your review. So here we go. It's a lot. As you see, you can post a lot of listings on one, um, which is great. Um, and also, it's fast. You see how fast it loaded? It didn't take a lot of time. It's instantly which i think users these days you don't want to have to wait you don't want to wait to load so if you're on your phone and you're strolling through a listing you don't want to wait long you're so used to instant instant service you want you want to show up too fast if it shows up slow then you're going to switch off the app and go to a different one because you don't want to be waiting long um for um a listing to show up you want things fast so one great thing about the steam is fast here you got the hours reviews photo gallery and and again you can also add you can customize this as well there's little blocks that shows up for your page and you can put in the blocks on the customized um wedges and choose which wedges you want for the listing page and so let's something else i need to show you on this one Hmm, it's probably about the same. All right, let's get out of that. We can just keep pulling. Okay, let's go to this one. So this was the next uh, demo. This demo here is for like um, apartments, rentals, Airbnb style, rental houses, things like that, apartments. So this is the second demo they came out with. So as you see here is the rental listings. This is your block, footer, and you know these are all add a property login pops up. You can add your social media logins there. You do a quick search. As you see here, this way show up. It shows the. Um, you know, the, the circle or the map that lets you know it's four listings inside this location, eight here. As you see, this here shows two. The last one will show four, but you can change it. If you want this, this demo, you can also make it three as well if you choose to. Here is your, um, your tags, which you can use for like amenities, your categories, uh, which you're looking for. You can search by name, but you know, this right here that you know your location and pull up the closest location to you. Here is um, the listings here. So let's pull one up. As you see here, this is more like a gallery. The first demo was like one large image. Here is a gallery which showed three images. And it's, you can click here and so you can stroll through as you see. Hit this button right here takes you straight down to the reviews, which is right here. Um, you can also customize and add another button here, which I did when I had this theme. You can add another button there for booking, book down, things like that. So you can add another button here if you customize it. Here, you got the profile, contact, take it to this person profile, this information, amenities. And as well, you can um, add a plugin with WooCommerce booking, which you can put here or here, wherever you want it. So customers can book. So if you don't want these two here, well, you want to remove these images and put the booking right here. You can put a booking plug in with WooCommerce right here. They have uh, a booking section. I don't know if they actually have it available on the demo. They used to. Um, not sure why they removed it. Let's see if I can find one. Um, yeah, they removed it. This is the image. Not sure why they removed it, but they did. So let's go to the third one. Here is their latest demo that they just came out with recently. It's the last demo that they came out with. It's similar to the last one. This one is more so um, classification, classified. So you want to do hotels, lodging, bars, restaurants, nightlife. So you just see here, you can do multiple. Here's the listings. You see the different designs. Uh, I, I actually like this lot design better than the other two demos. 
you know, you have more life to her, more color, as you see, which I really like. Um, let's do a search. And as you see here, it pulls up. It has to as well. But again, get the, um, your icons. So this theme don't have a customizable filter built in. What you have to do is that they have a plugin, which you have to use. You have to purchase a plugin, and you can actually make this more of a filtered um, option here. So this is what it comes like if you purchase a thing like this, but then you can purchase a plugin that they offer. And with that plugin, you can add more filters, bare rooms, bathrooms, you know, etc. So here is what they have on here. Let's click hotel. And as you see, this one is similar, but it, it have the directory here. And you know your icons, your amenities, your tags, your information, your logo, I mean your map, your um, information that you want to put here. But again, like I said before, if you want to use it and actually add a booking, you can add booking plugin on here as well. Um, check out the blog. Here's the blog. Let me see if they have a shopping on this one. Let's go back to this one. Let me see. Shopping price and coupon. Here we go. So this right here is their shopping. This is what the shopping look like. So if you want to add a shopping store to it, here you go. This is what it looks like. Um, let me see what else they have on here. Pricing. This is what the pricing look like. So you want to showcase pricing. Let's find mm -hmm. this right here. They set up as how it works icons and you can customize it how you want it to do so that's what i want to do you guys i just want to show you this quick um directory wordpress theme i really think that you will like it um as much It's not, it's, it's, it's not a lot of money. It's, so what happens is if you get the WordPress theme early, then you actually um, can benefit. So once, so that, that's what I try to do for you guys. When I see a theme, WordPress theme that come out that's nice and I think it's worth the money, I would tell you guys, hey, jump on this because this WordPress theme is a startup price. It's $19, $29, and that's the best time to buy it or once they come on sale. This thing here is now on sale. You can see it's $20. And as you see, the features are nice. It depends on what kind of website or startup or company you have. And if this WordPress theme fits your needs. The difference between WordPress theme and like sites like Squarespace and Wix is that in other sites is that you have to pay a per month fee for there. So there's, they offer everything, your security, they offer, um, you know, the whole website design, you can design yourself, but you got to pay a monthly fee. It depends on what features you want. You can be up to 100 bucks a month. So the difference with the WordPress is WordPress, you can buy the theme by yourself, especially if you get it on sale. You can spend between $19 to $59 and that's it. But you, of course, you have to have your own hosting. So, I mean, you can get hosting wordpress hosting for like 15 dollars. so 15 dollars a month plus 29 dollars or 59 dollars is much cheaper than spending a large amount of money 100 bucks or 50 bucks a month for squarespace or wix so it all depends on your needs what do you need in your website and you know just let me know um comment in the video send me an email Tell me, you know, hey, these are the features that I need. You know, I need a booking. I need scheduling. I need shopping. You know, I need an app with this WordPress theme. And I can tell you, hey, this would be the best WordPress theme for you because they offer these features. Uh, if you want to go with Squarespace, then let me know. I can send you, um, I think, a great Squarespace site for you based on what's available. I can send you a link for that and you can just sign up and then you know, get started with that. So uh, same thing with Wix. Let me know. Um, send me email, comments. You know, I'll be happy to help you. So until the next video, um, like and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys next time.
Peace.